Hi, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in this video, as you can see by the title, today I'm going to be doing a Shein summer try on haul. I want to only show you guys clothes in this video. Um, I plan on doing another one where it's like accessories only. It's kind of in need of some, some mainly longer dresses is what I'm going to show on here. I also put together like some outfits, you know, potential outfits that I might wear. Probably later in the month I'll have a part two because I do have another package on the way right now. Like as we speak, I have another package on the way. But before we get into the video, make sure to like like, comment, subscribe for more content and more videos for me. And let's go ahead and get on with the video. I'm trying to stock up on my maxi dresses, like I said. This dress right here, I've seen this on TikTok a couple times and it's like a skims type of dress, skims but on a budget. It's a pretty nice length as well. Um, it could be a little bit longer, but it's fine. And I'm pretty sure I got this in like an extra small. Even though it's one of those dresses that don't have a slit in them, I you can walk in this still. I can walk and not trip down the stairs or trip while walking or whatever. I only got it in this brown color. Um, they had a bunch of other colors on there, but I just wanted a simple brown dress. 10 out of 10 for this dress. This is gonna be on the top three of my favorite dresses in this haul, but this one is very nice. Like, look at it. It is a, you know, a satin, um, like slip dress. This one has a slit on the side right here. Um, it's like a, plum kind of color i think somewhat like that it's like crisscross somewhat in the back i'm not going to show the back because it's like kind of crazy but it's like a crisscross and like you tie it up yourself in the back they had a lot of colors on there too so i definitely want to go back and get more colors in this but this one absolutely 10 10 20 out of 10 like one of my top threes of this whole haul that i have going on next i have this dress right here this is like a tube dress um i usually don't ever get like tube or like strapless dresses this one i decided to go ahead and get because i really like the pattern of it this one does run big i got it in a size extra small i definitely got it in like a four it's tight but it's not it's not as tight as i kind of want it to be like, i swear right when i bought it like the day after i went back on there and they had like three new colors on there like i don't have a lot of blue so that's why i try to go for the blue color one and then these these um shoes that i'm wearing could even match with it eight out of ten because i feel like it could be tighter but everything else about it is nice it does have like this um ruche material here on the sides of the dress as well dark blue on the back here and then the front has the abstract uh design here this one like i said eight out of ten for this dress next is another tube top dress or tube dress it's a maxi dress and you know the length isn't horrible but i wish it was a little bit longer i think i'm i would be able to like stretch this out and make it a little bit longer on myself i feel like it would look better if it was like touching the floor at least or like a little bit more past my ankles tie dye brown color it has this nice slit on the side here. I think I'm gonna be able to stretch this out and wear it how I want to, but either way, it is still a nice cute dress. It is very stretchy, so that's why I say I'd be able to stretch it out and make it longer. And I believe I got this in a size small. I'm gonna give it like a seven out of 10. Um, if I can stretch it out, it's gonna become a eight out of 10. It's giving a seven out of 10 right now for me. Okay, so this next one right here, this one's really cute and I decided to go with blue, like a navy blue because I don't have a lot of navy blue like in my closet at all so I went for this color. It does like wrap up in the back here if you can kind of see that. It's not tied up or anything, I didn't tie it because I just don't feel like doing that right now. Again with the other dress, this one I feel like could be a little bit longer on me. It's not a swimsuit material but it kind of reminds me of it. I don't know what kind of material it is but it's like a kind of that like I don't even know how to explain it, but it's similar to a swimsuit material. It's kind of like that. If it was a little bit longer on me, I'd be a little bit more happy with it. I got this in a size small and I'm definitely, I'm going to give this one, it's a 6 out of 10 for me. So 6 out of 10 for this dress. So this next dress is what I'm talking about. This is exactly what I'm talking about. So it is a long sleeve dress, obviously. This one, it's a, a thin enough material also to wear it at night in the summertime. The length of this dress is what I'm talking about when it comes to the other two that I just tried on. I'm trying to have it like not on the floor, but like this is a really nice length, like where it's at right now. This is what I'm talking about for those other two dresses and this is what I wanted. So it has a slit on the side here, as you can see. This one is a really nice material. Like this one had a lot of good reviews. I believe I got in a small, definitely a small. And it also has like a ruche thing right here. It doesn't have a drawstring. You know how some dresses will have a drawstring on here, but it doesn't have that, just the like ruching thing. 
I don't know about wearing heels, but anyways, this one, 10 out of 10 for me. Okay, so next dress I have is this one right here. This one definitely is my one of my favorite dresses. Um, so it's like this pretty lime green color. Um, it definitely, so it's like a halter neck and it does tie up in the back. It's definitely more of a thicker material. It is kind of hot wearing it right now, but I guess it's okay for like a summer night, you know? And it's like an open back, so it's like a, you know, a normal halter dress. This is actually a petite dress and it's a size small, I believe. Um, I just wanted to make sure like the top part up here was going to be small enough for me because a lot of times tops that are like this, they never fit. They always have a gap. So this one does not have a gap. It fits perfectly on me. I love this dress. I love the color of it. The material, like I said, the material is a little bit, you know, thicker on the thicker side. So I'm trying to wrap this up so I can take it off because I'm hot right now. But this one gets a 10 out of 10 for me. And then, of course, since I love that dress so much, I went ahead and got a different color. This is a pink color. They had a bunch of other ones on there, too. But I got a pink and a green one over there. Um, so same thing, same material, same everything. Sometimes when you get a dress, you order another one in a different color and it comes in like a whole nother texture or material, whatever. So these two are the same material, that same like, you know, kind of hot-ish material. So I'm about to take this off soon, but this is what this one looks like. Um, the same size, I got a small petite in both of them. So yeah, this one also gets a 10 out of 10. The next one I have is this dress right here. This is a like bright kind of like bubblegum pink dress. Um, this one's a little bit, it's on the thinner side and it is a little bit like see-through. Like I feel like if I got a lighter color, like a white one or cream or something, it definitely would be all the way see-through, but it's not bad for the pink. You probably can't even see that, but it is like a rib material, but it's just thin and stretchy. There's like a collar on the top here. And then it also has uh, short sleeves, as you can see. This one's either a small or extra small because the reviews did say it ran a little bit big. Just a quick little throw-on dress. So this one, I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give this one like a seven out of ten. I, I'm looking in the mirror right now. I kind of, it is a little see-through. It is see-through for sure. Yeah, I'm gonna give it like a seven out of ten for this one. I believe this is like the last dress that I have. Um, this one's very short. Um, if you're a little taller than me, I don't know. I got this in a size medium because, no, 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 I got it in a small, I got a small, but it is a little bit like short and I kind of don't like it that much. I don't really have a shape to begin with, but this one really makes me look like a box. So I'm not, I'm not really a fan of this dress. I like the color. I mainly got it for the color. Like it's not flattering. It doesn't really look that good on me. So I'm gonna end and in the back here, it's like, it's not that noticeable, but it does have like a gap in the back. I'm giving this like a 5 out of 10. I like the color, I like the pattern, but it's just not, it's not looking, it don't look right on me. It don't look flattering at all, so 5 out of 10 for this dress. This next one, I, I love this one. I had it in my mind, I imagined it, da da da, like this one actually came out good. Um, honestly, they're both like basic pieces, so like it wouldn't have really failed me anyways. This is basically like a bikini top, to be like to be honest, but it's like a really thin material. It was actually cheap, like maybe like $4, $3. It was cheap when I got it. But it's like a basically a halter top, really a bikini, but or bikini top, but it does crisscross in the front here and in the back it does tie up like a normal halter. Um, I tied it up very tightly because when I first tried this on, um, it did not fit me. It was too big, but I just made it a little bit tighter. That's all you gotta do. The skirt, I do not have a long denim skirt. Like I don't even have a denim skirt, like a, a blue denim skirt. So I went ahead and got this one. This one's very cute, very nice. It's like a normal denim, I guess. It's not really anything special to it. Crosses up in the back here for the top. And then for the skirt, it does have like a slit in the back, as you can see. Both pieces get a 10 out of 10 for sure. Like, both of them. This top, I can even wear this with like some denim shorts or, you know, jeans, whatever. I can wear anything with this top. And the bottoms, I can wear with anything too. So, both these pieces definitely get a 10 out of 10. I love both of them. I love the outfit itself. 10 out of 10 for both of this. 10 out of 10 for the whole outfit too. I don't know why. I feel like this is like crooked on me or something, but... This next outfit right here, y'all. I did not plan on putting this together, but it fits so well. I ordered this top to go with some white pair of jeans, and then I ordered the bottoms here for, it was like a white top I had. I don't know, but I ordered them separately for separate different outfits that I had in mind, 
and I just pulled out everything and saw that the colors on this match this pretty pretty well actually like they're kind of spot on first of all the jeans or the pants whatever they're not really they're not a jean material at all they're like a really stretchy I guess jaggy material they're not jean material but they're long enough for me which I love about that they're very long um, they're comfortable I got these in a size extra small I wanted some like cargo um, khaki type of pants to go with some stuff and then for the top here it's like a knitted halter top it's not itchy it's not uncomfortable and it has like this little ring thing right here in the middle um, and it's a halter so it does tie up in the back all the way this whole outfit is a 10 out of 10 the pieces individually I'm gonna give I'm gonna give the top like a 8 out of 10 I feel like maybe it's just me I'm looking at two different mirrors. Maybe it's just me, but I feel like the top is crooked. It's probably maybe how I put it on. When I first put it on, I felt like it was crooked too, so I don't know. The bottoms, 10 out of 10. Top is an 8 out of 10. So this next one that I have is this like kind of monochromatic, uh, all blue type of outfit. I actually wasn't even planning to get this shirt, but I just kind of threw it in the cart. Um, it was cute on the model, but it looks a little awkward and like weird on me. It's like a halter, so it does tie up in the back. It has like this little cut out here in the front and then a drawstring. I'm giving this top like a 5 out of 10. It's not all that cute on me. Um, on the model, it looked good, but on me, it looks a little weird. So 5 out of 10 for the top here. For the bottoms though, these ones are very nice. Like they're very stretchy. They have like a flare at the bottom kind of. They do have like the belt loops. They have pockets real pockets in the front here these are like um what's it called like straight leg i think straight leg uh jeans bottoms they're gonna be a 9 out of 10 until i stretch them out they'll be a 10 out of 10. i'm probably not gonna wear this but i'm gonna rate this out for like a good a good like six seven out of ten for the whole outfit i'll probably never wear this because this top i'm not really gonna wear 10 out of 10 for the bottoms, 5 out of 10 for the top, and like a 7 out of 10 for the outfit. Well, I set up and filmed this whole try-on haul with no air on. It's like 90 degrees outside. I'm trying to finish this outro out because once the outro is done, I'm about to cut on this air. Alright, so that's all for this video. Hope you guys liked the video and everything I showed. And if you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe for more content and more videos from me. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!